is Nicole Cooper, your Austin area specialist, and we're here with another Monday market update during the COVID-19 pandemic. It's May 4th, and this past week we've had a bit more activity than the prior weeks. The new listings that were on the market were up actually 25%. We changed from 204 properties new to the market to 256 new properties on the market. Pending sales up 19%. We had 288 Aww. properties go under contract last week, and the prior seven days we had 342 properties go under contract. We had 50% more properties taken off the market. Either people just decided it was time to wait or give up. Um, <laughs> well, there you go. We're videoing from home. Nothing's perfect. Um, anyway, we have some news from the year over year finally to kind of mark what's happening with the virus. Um, month over month, from 2019 to 2020, we are still up on average sale price and median sale price. So January of 2020, February, March, and April were up over their same months in 2019. The one thing we're starting to notice now is the number of sales has dropped. In April of 2020, sales the number of sales dropped 35% from the number of sales in 2019. Now, I would expect that to be higher in May, and that is because we didn't actually go into shelter in place until March 23rd. So a portion of April's closings would have been completed before March, gone under contract anyway, before March 23rd, and we could consider that a somewhat normal market. So I would expect um, May's number of properties to be reduced to about half because the listings that in April were reduced to about half. And so were the number of, of active pendings and things. So we'll see as it comes. Um, properties are still moving. They're going very, very quickly. There are still multiple offers. So if you need any help deciding what to do, give me a call. This is our Austin area market data. And I'm Nicole Cooper, your Austin area specialist for real estate. Until next week, stay safe.